See, I'm coming to you here from the chapel at the University of Mississippi. This is the Paris Yates Chapel. Mr. Paris is uh, of the Jewish faith and his wife uh, was a, uh, of the Christian faith. They joined together to build this chapel here or have their name on it, the Paris Yates Chapel. Uh, and it is a landmark here at our university. I'm coming to you here on this animal cruelty subject with the Tennessee walking horses. We, we now have, in the past act, to remove the pads and chains from the Big Lick Tennessee walking horse, a total of 149 co-sponsors. That only leaves 69 till we have the magic number of 218. That's a great number starting off. We need to finish it up. We need to get the rest of them. Over Middle Tennessee and Kentucky, in the last three or four weeks, there have been a number of what we call baby horses. These are horses that are two months, 24 months old, more or less, some a little younger, one or two a little older, uh, under saddle, wearing the big, paint, big pads and the shoes uh, that they call stacks and the chains. And these horses have been started under saddle at 16, 17, 18 months of age. This is a travesty. This is why, and if you notice this label here, the American Horse Council, Tennessee Walking Horse is not allowed to be a member of the American Horse Council. That's because of the Big Lick Animal Cruelty. We have here, it's a pariah, but the Citizens' Campaign Against Big Lick Animal Cruelty is not only a member of the American Horse Council, it's a sponsor. I plan to continue to be a sponsor on behalf of the people appreciate the bell ringing for us today. It's a beautiful, beautiful carillon. Let me tell you something. It's 110 days today since I was at the chapel at the University of Maryland to celebrate the life of Senator Joseph Tidings. At that time, I happened to meet uh, Speaker Nancy Pelosi. She's a marvelous lady. She spoke to me. We listened to each other. And I told her I was doing this animal cruelty work, and she asked what she, could she do to help. Well, since that time, we've gotten 149 co-sponsors on a bill with to who large animal vets, a Republican and a Democrat, and we're gonna go to victory with that. You stay the course, stay the faith, keep the faith, be with us all the way. Thank you so much, coming to you here from the University of Mississippi.